Hi, this video is the uh, uh, before and after hair transplant of Destiny Godly. I'm going to introduce, show the before and after video, a picture real quick, and then Destiny going to explain her um, her journey and about how, how, when she saw me, how and why she chose my clinic and what's it like doing the uh, surgery and the recovery and what's the year like. But again, this is what before and after will look like for her. And look at how beautiful she is. It's fantastic. Okay, the stage is all yours, Destiny. Hey guys, my name is Destiny Godley, and I got my hair done with Dr. Deep at the MHTA clinic about a year ago. And um, I've always had a naturally high hairline. I've always been self-conscious about it, always got made fun of. It's something that runs in my family, so it wasn't something I could escape naturally. I tried lotions and creams and potions and all types of rubs and braids and tried to get my hair to grow naturally, but being as there were no follicles, I couldn't do anything about it. So I decided to look into hair transplantation, hairline lowering, making my forehead smaller, all types of things that I tried to search for and for a while I didn't find anything that was interesting. I found doctors that would chop your head up and leave you with scars and all types of just unattractive results. And one day I typed in I believe on YouTube um, hair transplantation and I've seen a couple of videos from Dr. Deep and then I decided to further Google him and came to learn that he not only specializes in hair transplantation for women but ethnic women and then the fact that my hair was curly was also something that I had to take into consideration because a lot of people just don't specialize and don't really focus on the hair care for ethnic, African American, or multicultural people, especially women. And when I found out that he did not only specialize in it, but it was something that was somewhat of a niche for him, I was very, very excited. Um, I've seen a couple of results that he did on African American men and women and transgendered um, men to women. So I was really, really excited about that. Um, first I did a email consultation by sending him pictures of me front, top, side, side, and back. And he contacted me and kind of let me know exactly how we would go about it. And I was eager to start ASAP because I felt as though he'd really care and he'd take my hair into serious consideration and not just go and put hair up there. So when we finally did meet very very um specific with how i wanted my hair we talked and he promised me that he'd do exactly what i wanted and he did um the surgery day was really easy i flew out here to san jose stayed in a hotel came to the clinic got pretty much the outpatient sur uh, surgery so i didn't have to stay in the hospital very long or anything like that after the surgery, I went back to the hotel and the next day I went home. So it was fast and it was easy, which is really important for me because I do work online. I work as a beauty um, as a beauty guru on YouTube. I do blogging and I'm also an aspiring actress. So it was really important that my hair not only look natural, but recover fast and look like something that fits my face and not just have a weird hairline. I know a lot of people that have gone to other really popular hair transplantation um, services and, and got hairlines that don't fit their face or even their culture. I didn't even know that you know different races had different shaped hairlines so I learned a lot from him and I'm very very happy with my surgery. Very happy with my results. It's so easy and freeing. I have so much more confidence. I can do things that I've never could do before. I can wake up, put a little product in my hair and go. I can go to the beach, get in the water, it's no problem. Um, my scar is easily hidden. Yeah, it was just a really easy and just great experience. I definitely wouldn't trade it for the world. I do it over 10 times and um, I heal fast. It's only been a year and I have a head full of hair. You know, maybe for a week or two I was a little discombobulated, but I was right back on track very fast and very, very happy with my results. I documented everything online, so if you guys want to see any more about my journey or my experience with Dr. Deep, you can definitely check me out on YouTube.com slash the number one Destiny Godly 
or youtube.com slash destiny godly i have everything from even before i had my official consultation with dr deep i announced my surgery and then you can see how fast from there i moved forward because i was completely confident and completely enthusiastic about working with the doctor and i still am and i plan to have my scar filled in in a few months and continue on with my perfect hair thanks to dr deep at the mhta clinic thank you thank you Definitely.